Hi, and welcome to the first edition of the 2016-27 school year Students of the Month, Cherokee High School here on LDTV. I'm Josh Gladstone, and I'll be your host again this year. Our first Student of the Month is freshman Paige Esposito. Congratulations on being Student of the Month. Thank you. So why do you think you were nominated as Student of the Month? To be honest, I have no idea. I mean, I do field hockey for Cherokee, so maybe that's why, but otherwise, no idea. Okay, that, that, that's a perfect lead into our second question. Uh, what is your involvement here at Cherokee? I do field hockey, I'm a goalie, I do smack and renaissance. What advice do you have to freshmen like yourself or just anyone in general? Well, I've learned over my month or two at Cherokee that everything you do does count towards senior year in college and your future, so just try your best at everything. That's, a, that's some pretty good advice right there. Um, now, next question. Uh, who inspires you? Who's your uh, number one source of inspiration? My parents, because they do a lot for my family and just help me out in many different ways. So That's, that's some pretty good inspiration there. Um, do you think you have any idea who nominated you for this honor of Student of the Month? Maybe my coaches for field hockey, but other than that, I'm not sure. Uh, why do you think your coaches? Because I was never a goalie and I've never played before, so I stepped up for the freshman team and played goalie, and it turns out I liked it, so maybe that's it. So this is your first year actually playing field hockey? Yeah. Wow, that's pretty impressive in your whole team. Um, okay, very, very hard question for you. You've only been here for a month. Do um, you have a favorite memory or you have something you're going to look forward to as a Cherokee student for well, the next four years? I think everyone's looking forward to Disney, so. I know I am. Yeah. Can't wait. Um, and here's a personal question for you. Uh, what do you enjoy doing in your free time? I like hanging out with friends or playing softball. So, so you like softball. Yeah. Do you plan on trying out for the softball team during the spring season? Yeah. It's fantastic, a two-sport athlete. Yeah. And then our final question for today, uh, again, not a hard one since you're a, only a freshman. Uh, what are your plans for after high school? I plan on going to college and doing something in the medical field, but I'm not exactly sure yet. Medical field is actually a good idea because that's the one field that's always hiring and yeah. you're always guaranteed a job within that field. Yeah, that's a lot of people tell me. It's a really good field. Uh, congratulations for being Student of the Month thank and you. thank you for coming on the show today. Our next Student of the Month for October is sophomore Ryan Bassett. Thanks for coming on today. Thank you. So why do you think you were selected as Student of the Month? Um, I don't really know, but I think um, I have a lot of good relationships with my teachers. and. Okay. Uh, um, what involvement do you have here at Cherokee? Um, I'm involved in football and baseball, and I play football for the Cherokee. I play football for Cherokee. Uh, what position do you do for uh, football and baseball? Uh, I play wide receiver for football, and I play um, outfield for baseball. Nice. Uh, what advice do you have to underclassmen or just uh, anyone in general? Uh, to just get involved with a lot of things and good relationships with their teachers. Yeah, you always got to be friends with your teachers. Benefits will increase. Um, uh, who inspires you the most? Like, uh, what's your biggest source of inspiration? My parents are always pushing me to get good grades and keep my grades, grades up. Perfect. Um, so do you have any idea what teacher nominated you for Student of the Month? Uh, I don't know. I have a lot of good relationships with my teachers. We'll find out in May. Yeah. Um, now you're only a sophomore, so you've only been here for like, what, a year and like a month? Yeah. Uh, what is your favorite memory or something that you're looking forward to in the future? Um, my favorite memory is probably just hanging out and going to the football field every day with my friends and just playing with them. That's pretty cool. Um, you have a personal question. Uh, what do you enjoy to do in your free time? Um, I like to just practice football and hang around with my friends. Okay, perfect. And our last question, you're only a sophomore, so you got you know, some time to think about this. Uh, what are your plans for after high school? I want to go to college and have good ed education. Uh, do you have any idea what you want to major in or uh, do with your life? I think uh, I might want to do a sports business, like a business thing and like sports. Oh, we have a class for that here in elective sports yeah. management. Are you in it? Or? Yeah, I'm in that. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, congratulations for being student of the month. Thank you. Thanks for coming down. Thank you. Our next student of the month is junior Ashwin Mahadevan. Congratulations on being student of the month. Thank you. So why do you think you were selected as Student of the Month? 
So over the summer, I spent a lot of time in Cherokee, like volunteering and helping out with teachers. I helped Miss Mayer, who's like the English department head, like organize her books in the book room. And I also gave a lot of tours to freshmen who were incoming and with their parents. And I know that the teachers and the principals were really appreciative of how much time I spent here. So I feel like that was one of the main components of why I was Student of the Month. Right, nice. Uh, what's your involvement here at Cherokee? So I'm involved with the theater program here at Cherokee, so I do the fall and the spring shows, and that takes up most of my time. But I'm also a part of the choir program. I'm in the concert choir and the chamber choir, and I'm on the student council board, and I'm on, on the newspaper. Wow, that's a lot of activities. Yeah. Um, just out of curiosity, uh, what show are you guys going to be doing this fall? We're doing a funny thing happen on the way to the forum, and it's really funny because I'm like an old, insane guy in the show. And that's a, a comedy, I believe? Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, I gotta see that. Yeah. Sounds interesting. Um, what advice do you have to uh, underclassmen or just uh, anyone in general? So they should really try to get involved in the school because like you'll you have your friends in your classes and your teachers but if you get involved in these other clubs especially theater you'll make these new friends that are possibly in different grade levels and then you just have a really like a broader friend group and you'll have friends wherever you go in the school. It's actually probably one of the best advices I've actually ever heard. Mm -hmm. Um, next question, what's your inspiration? Uh, who inspires you the most? So, uh, about two years ago, my father passed away, and so he's been my real inspiration. He's the one that motivates me to do everything I'm doing and keep going. Wow, I'm really sorry for your loss. Um, do you, who do you think nominated you as student of the month? So, I think it was either Miss Mayer, who I helped a lot over the summer, and I keep in touch with her a lot, or Mr. New, because I was with him for the tours all throughout the summer, and he was really happy with what we were doing and what I was doing. Oh, we'll, we'll find out in May. Yeah. Um, so you're a junior, so of all the three years, or two years and two years and change you've been here, mm -hmm. um, what is your favorite memory? So it's, it's a memory that's rooted in school, but it wasn't exactly in Cherokee. Yeah. So last year, we went to the White House with our concert choir, and we sang, I like, and the president wasn't there, but it was like all the senators and the congressmen. But that was actually on my 16th birthday, so that was a really special time. Wow, mm -hmm. really interesting. Mm -hmm. Um, and then here's a personal question. Uh, what do you enjoy to do in your free time? So I play the piano as well. So I spend a lot of time on that. And then, like, of course, I watch TV and all that, but sometimes you don't have as much time because there's homework. But <laughs> I, like, relaxing is a really, like, it's really fun when you have the time. Oh, it always is fun to relax. Like, yeah. I try to do as much as I can because yeah. I'm really busy. I do the Option 2 program and I do this. Yeah. So, like, I understand you mm -hmm. pretty well. Our last question for today is, uh, what are your plans for after high school? So I'm not sure yet. I, don't, I definitely want to go to college, but I want to major in something like maybe government or international relations because I really like talking to people and interacting with people, but I'm not sure where I want to go. Oh, very interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, thanks for your time. Thank you. Congratulations for being student of the month. Thank you. Our final student of the month for October is senior Sarah Riley. She was unavailable for an interview. When you are faced with the decision to be a bystander or an upstander, what would you choose? If you're Sarah Riley, you choose the latter. She brought an issue to Mr. Lin's attention and the fellow Cherokee administration, which was then resulted in a fellow student getting the attention and help that was truly needed. That will do it for this edition of Cherokee Students of the Month here on LDTV. For all of us here at the studio, I'm Josh Gladstone. See you next time here on Students of the Month.